I had the pleasure of going up to the Portland Museum of Art. The Richard Estes exhibit was a real treat. This is a man absolutely at the height of his power. It's really phenomenal to see the works in person and sort of see the vignettes. Yes, a photorealist, and no doubt about it, the pictures as you see them here on the television screen are very much realistic. I'm Jessica May, I'm a curator of contemporary and modern art at the Portland Museum of Art. I was one of the curators of this exhibition, Richard Estes Realism. Richard Estes' story as an artist of the 20th and increasingly 21st century is a really great story. He's someone who comes of age as a childhood photo enthusiast in rural Illinois, becomes a student at the School of the Art Institute of Chicago, which then is now one of the premier art schools in this country. Where did Richard Estes start drawing? First, let me talk about Richard Estes. He was a founder of the imperialism. This artistic movement is characterized by the ability of capturing reality, like an image. His history. He started his studies in 1952 at the Art Institute of Chicago. Later, in 1959, he moved out to New York, where he worked on three pieces that are exposed in Tizen. 